Hello everyone, welcome to With Love Tarot. Today I will be answering the question of whether you will reconcile with your ex. Now this is going to be for the main person um, that you're thinking about, the most um, significant relationship that you've had, whoever is on your mind. I will pull one card and then a clarifier and if I feel like I need to pull other cards, I will do that as well. Viewers and subscribers, will they be reconciling with their ex? For my viewers and subscribers, will they be reconciling with their ex? Will they have a reconciliation with their ex partner? Okay, so we have the Two of Wands. Now, the Two of Wands um, definitely talks about uh, having to make a decision of some sort um, or choose. You're basically, um, this could be for you or the person you're dealing with is, is kind of at a crossroads. Um, they're on the verge of making a decision. Wands... Um, is really about action and energy and fire so one or both of you is really on the verge of making a decision of some sort i'm going to um pull a couple more cards on that and also i just want to mention at the bottom of the deck is the hierophant and this is a great sign this is a great omen because the hierophant for me um, especially in this particular spread and for this question talks about commitment and taking a romantic relationship to the next level so the next card we have is the three of pentacles and i think that this is also a great sign um for reconciliation um, kind of after this after a decision has been made to work together the three of Pentacles uh, speaks about working together collaborating um, kind of teamwork this could also um, the message that I'm getting is maybe some type of counseling or third person um, will aid you guys um, to work together and reconcile or work together on your relationship. And again, with the Hierophant at the bottom, this could be about um, deciding to take the relationship to the next level or even renewing your vows. So I'm going to use a different deck to um, clarify both of these cards. Please clarify the Two of Wands and Three of Pentacles. Please clarify the Two of Wands and Three of Pentacles. clarify the two of wands and three of pentacles. One more. Hi Raja. Hi. <laughs> Raja has joined the reading. Hi lovey. Okay, good boy. Yes. 
Oh, beautiful, guys. We have the Sun card. And, okay, so <laughs> this is not um, the greatest card to get, but it does um, kind of speak about being in a situation to finally have to take the blindfold off and make a decision, which kind of ties into um, the Two of Wands. Um, it's the Eight of Swords is, is not such a bad card in the sense that um, it's noteworthy that she's kind of, or he or she is, is kind of like in, in their own head type of thing. And they could easily take the blindfold off and um, they're not restrained, basically. Um, it's self-imposed. So perhaps um, this collaboration I was uh, speaking of earlier is going to help whoever this is get out of their own head and work together. But going back to this card, which is an excellent card for reconciliation, reunion, and just happiness, um, I think that this says that whatever decision is made, that it's going to be a positive one and it's going to be in your favor for sure and it's going to make you very happy. And I am going to just take one more card to seal this reading. Just give me one more card if there are any other messages. Reconciliation. Okay, great. Um, it, oh, we have the King of Pentacles at the bottom, and um, we also have the Page of Pentacles here. So this, for me, um, talks about messages. Pages mean messages, especially um, in this deck. And this is an offer of some sort. This could be uh, a message or an invitation or even a gift because I like to point out that this pentacle he's holding is humongous in relation to the size of his body so whatever he's holding it's very valuable to him and it's um, high worth this could be a gift and sometimes I also see this as a ring in a proposal so going back to the Hierophant I saw um, this really could be about getting back together and there being some type of commitment. So I think that for um, the month of September, that many of you will be reconciling with your significant others, um, at the very least uh, working towards it. And I'm getting just an overall um, happy feeling. So I wish you all the best of luck, and if you like the video, please like, share, and subscribe. I will continue to do them for you. Thanks. Bye.